Well, it's about that time I talk about something that I haven't seen. But is this movie really all that great? Is it really that special? Let's find out. Ghost in the Shell is a 1995 fantasy mystery film directed by Mamoru Oshii and is adapted from the manga of the same name. And the plot of Ghost in the Shell, the animated version, is the cyborg federal agent Ma Major Matoko Konzanagi trails the puppet master who illegally hacks the computerized minds of cyborg human hybrids. Her pursuit of a man who can modify the identity strangers leaves Motoko pondering her own makeup and what life might be like if she had more human traits. With her partner, she corners the hacker, but with curiosity about her identity sends the case in an unforeseen direction. Now the original question at the beginning of this video was, is this movie really that good? Yes, it is. I really enjoy Ghost in the Shell. It is a very amazing anime film, and I actually I never seen this before. So last night was my first time watching this movie, and just this movie is so fun, so awesome, and just this movie has inspired a lot of people. And it serves inspiration for a lot of filmmakers. It, it, it leaves a big influence on people with the Wachowskis, for the Matrix. Just a lot of a lot of it is this is just is a great film. It's also been inspired a number of films. Um, for including. Is excluding James Cameron's Avatar, artificial intelligence, surrogates, just this movie is pretty much an inspiration for the films. It's just really cool, and just this movie you have a lot of things to praise. Uh, this movie is set set the tone for anime. Just really cool. It's a really fun anime, and I'm gonna talk about it. So let's go. Particularly, what people really like to praise about this movie is the overarching philosophical themes in this movie. Self-identity and technology advanced world. A lot of themes going on in this movie. Just, wow. You, it's really um, just amazing. And just the themes in this movie, gender identity, all that stuff. This movie begins with the perfect pair Handosical introduction to a narrative that is all about gender identity, self identity. That I do praise, and just that was just something really, really funny. And the movie has a 95% on Rotten Tomatoes. This movie is a thoughtful, complex treat for anime fans and an introduction for for people for the new genre. I like anime, of course. I love Dragon Ball. Of course, and I like the Animatrix, so I wanted to see see what was all the buzz with this film, and just this, and I and I did. I just like it. The music in in this movie is just pretty cool. I love the music by composer Ken Kai. The main theme is really cool, and just you have corals, score, and just. The orchestra in this movie is just really good. It's just really cool. I just like it. It's a really fun film. And you also have go this there's also a updated version, Ghost in the Shell 2.0, which I which includes digital film animation techniques, 3D CGI, a new opening, those holograph, and just that's a lot of stuff. So yeah. I do admit that that's pretty cool and just that's just really cool. I love 
the animation. The animation in here is just very good. Digital generate animation is just pretty cool. You got cell animation, computer graphics, and just air, how this how the movie plays out is just in with this animation. It works really cool with the animation on Avic technology. Just a lot of amazing illustrations, compositions, manipulations, all the work that went into the animation. I give credit to all of the animation people, including the director. And the opening credits are just really cool too. Those are very cool. And I love the design, the film, the character design, everyone is really cool. The way the futuristic look feels, because I do like movies to take place in the future, that's really cool. That's very, very creative with with this film and just the director he he took very good care of this he took very good care of the character and just yeah i think the character just the story is of this is in good hands and just when you get to the reveal at the end of this movie about the identity it's just really amazing i won't spoil it for any of you guys have not seen it but i have to say it is impressive. It is really cool. And just, I do, really do appreciate that aspect. And that's just very amazing and very, very, very creative. And I give the director a lot of credit for that. That's just something out of the park that he nailed perfectly. Another thing I, I have to really talk about is the voice casting. Maruko Kansangi, all the Japanese actors do really good, but they're dubbed over for English by English actors, and the main character, I like the main character, the major, Maruko Kansangi, and Scarlett Johansson, she has a lot to live up to as this character, and so is the, that live action version, it has a lot to live up to, so it has to be good, and just... The way this movie is presented to you is you don't get the feeling that this movie is going to be boring. You don't get the feeling that this movie is going to be terrible. With this, with this animated version, and it's not boring. It's not. It's it's ninety five minutes. It's an hour and thirty five minutes worth of your time. It's just pretty cool. And pretty, pretty amazing there. It's 82 minutes long. And just really cool stuff. And just really amazing. So, yeah. I do very much enjoy Ghost in the Shell. Overall, Ghost in the Shell is a really fun anime film. It is real, just as good as critics and anime fans say it is. And it respects the source material very very well and I can't I can't take this movie for granted because there is just a lot of cool things in it so yeah it's a really fun amazing film and it's a good time and I'm going to give Ghost in the Shell 1995 an A plus plus with my JD RSA my rainbow self approval I definitely recommend watching Ghost in the Shell. And stay tuned very soon for my review of Ghost in the Shell 2 Innocence. And thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, you can click right here and we can all have a good time.